and then you lock that into place, and you do it again. Oh, gee. Can you explain how the arrows work again? Um, if I turn continuously forward for this pattern, the arrows will point away from me, and you can see the arrows starting. Right. Yeah. If I turn continuously backwards, the arrows will point towards me. <laughs> and then if I do four forwards, four backwards, I'll get diamonds because the two oh. arrows will meet together. And you said this was from 800 BC they figured out to do this. Yeah, yeah. at least 800 BCE. The um, piece that they found was in amazingly, incredibly technical. It was, it was not as simple as this. Every card was turned individually every time you passed your shuttle through. So instead of turning it like, oh, that got wrong. Instead of turning it like this, they would turn this card this way, this card this way, this card this way, this card this way. And then they pass the shuttle through, and then they do it all over again. But you know, they didn't watch TV or have cell phones. Yeah, they had a lot of but They were better off. Yeah. <laughs> In some ways. So, so, so yeah. what did they find? Did they find the work, or did they find the uh, loom? They found the work. This okay. loom is a 19th century invention. A lot of the times it would be like um, a stick and a stick with a crossbar in between them, and that was their list. Like a giant H, essentially, was we found in one of the Viking ship burials. Or they would tie one end to themselves, and then the far end to like a tree or something sturdy. Okay. 